Hope your weekend's off to a great start. We are tracking that heat today, the 11th day in a row that we've seen temperatures in the 90s. Not quite as hot today as we've been. We only made it to 91, but the humidity, the big story, and it continues into your Sunday. So again, we're talking about highs reaching the mid 90s, feeling like those triple digits. So again, if you do have plans to be outside, please dress light, stay hydrated and take frequent breaks. That'll be the key uh, to staying safe outside. As we take a look at future casts, again, a quiet start to the day, not much in the way of showers. Keep in mind, though, any rain we see could certainly be impactful on the heavy side, packing a lot of lightning and gusty winds. We saw that on your Saturday across the I-40 corridor. Can't pinpoint exactly where they'll set up for your Sunday, but I think by and large, the best coverage will be up in the high country uh, for your Sunday. The bigger picture does show we are tracking better rain chances. That's going to arrive with a cold front that's setting up uh, across the Midwest. It's going to merge with another area of rain out there across the Rockies and then move into our deck of the woods as we head towards early next week. So rain chances start to climb as the ridge of high pressure weakens some. So better rain chances on Monday, but by Tuesday with that front, you'll see that line starting to work on through. It looks like those showers could be earlier in the day with cooling temperatures as we go throughout. So behind this front is where our relief is, and it's going to be dramatic. I want to show you that seven day forecast that pinpoints the relief from the heat is just around the corner. We go to mid 90s on Sunday, low to mid 90s on Monday, but we are crashing those temperatures down into the low 80s for Tuesday. We'll stay below average for much of next week. Second half of the weekend looks fantastic. That's your forecast. Have a great evening.